can't tell him what that stuff is. Yeah. Tell him what all that is. Um, these are all a mini Catlea uh, type of orchid, so it's blends of like Sulfurnitis, uh, Catlea, and uh, Brassias, and this is a Pragmapedium, and this is Pragmapedium uh, Slimii, I don't remember what this one is, uh, that's, that one, this one, and this one are all Pragmapediums. Um, these are more like from the Peru area, um, or Ecuador probably, this one is both Ecuador and Peru, and then this is more Ecuadorian. Back there, that's the uh, Patio Petalin. Um, You're going to be alright, we can go sit inside. Oh, I'm fine. Uh, I'm trying to remember what the breed is. Yeah, I that's, think I can do it. I can make it here. I don't know how much I'm saying that. Oh, it's Topper Eye. Yeah. And then yeah. that's Phalaenopsis. Yeah, that's me. And those are more of these mini cats there. that I got up well, there just to get a little more air movement. Kind of narrow, um, we got real. some jade plants back there. Yeah, that big one there. there is a Catlea from Hausermann's that blooms around Christmas time. So, so if you look at like these two here have these little bloom sheets coming out so they're getting ready to bloom off of that but not until December then this one here you see it's got a nice flower spike coming up so uh, that's a really cool one when it blooms then this is a pragmapedium back there okay kind of step back so you can see how this is set up so we can see the whole setup the netting that's because you have the netting up there like that. Because they like very bright shade. They, they, they don't like a lot of sunlight. Yeah, well they tend to grow either in trees or under trees. So they get a lot of dappled light, but it needs to be pretty bright. Okay.